Hi everyone, the Lone Wolf here. Welcome back to the World of Warcraft. This is the Battle for Azeroth pre-patch. And in today's video, I'm playing a little bit with Vobo. And we will see if we can get all of this to work. I also have a special food buff that uh, launches fireballs uh, occasionally at the enemy. So we will see if we can get this to work. The aim here is for me to learn a bit more about my rotation, do damage just like Phobo. He's also on his Elemental Shaman. He's actually quite a bit better than me at doing all that damage. And uh, we'll see if we can get it to work. There are the fireballs and everything else as well, which is pretty damn cool. Let's uh, get that one away. And then let's try to, let's see, mm, that's not worth it to hex him. To hex him could be good. All right, time for this. Time for my elementals to come in. And let's see if we can deal a bit of damage to that death knight. All right, do some more of that. I think it's gonna be time for, okay, a pot even. Uh, can't get out of that anymore. Is our healer here? He is. Let's get towards him. Try and play this smart. Okay, got enough for an earth shock at this point. So let's use it. It's a good bit of damage. Need a little bit more. Oh, Paladin is also healing himself up. See if I can still stun him like that. Worked. Slow him down. Just need a bit more. Come on. Yep, he's down. Good. Warlock next. Stop that drain life. He's done. Okay. Let's uh, let's try and keep him busy here for now. Put my earth shield back. Go after that monk. That has been secured. So that's pretty good. Let's see. Do we secure this or do we go after that alliance card? There's still someone back there as well, a demon hunter. Maybe we can help him out. And there's a paladin there as well. Let's give him earth shields. Give him some healing as well. Just because he's been holding on so well, I think we should try and help him. All right, stun totem, slowing down totem. That one is down. This is in control again. All right, let's turn around. Put my earth shield back up here. Okay, let's uh, focus maybe on that warlock then. Instead. S Jesus Christ, completely missed that. It's actually really bad. Okay, a bit more. A bit more maelstrom. All right, so now we get... Pretty much a stun ready. That's a dead hunter. Let's see if we can take that card. Ooh, this is quite quite one-sided. Um, right, getting out of that. Very important that you try and use your uh, fire elemental as much as possible. Let's see if I can't. God damn it. Uh, the reason for that is he actually gives you maelstrom uh, on every tick from your flame shock. So that is actually pretty important. Let's Earthshock that guy. He is, all right, stopped for now. Oh, good God, this is going so surprisingly well. Let's also knock him back. Just making sure that we secure the card here. All right, they are retreating. Next up, we've got a rogue here. They are quite dangerous. I'm actually going to also put up my totems just like Phobo did. And he melts. Hunter melts as well. <laughs> well, they are not always that one-sided. But this is definitely pretty cool to see. Let's indeed help the healer here. That druid healer must have been doing a really incredible job. And I think we could try to quickly kill this. And then, well, if they have one card, that's okay, my book. All right, he feared me, but he just died. Next up, we've got the mage. Maybe we should try and um, disrupt him a little bit with a hex. Like that. So now he wants to poly. 
Let's go. Use Earthshock. That is the one thing that I definitely have to learn. That is to use more Earthshock. Because it is a lot of damage that you do that way. Get in range for the guard. Then uh, maybe focus on the priest. Try to stop that shadow man, but I was too late. Bit more damage. And there go my fireballs. And that's my, my necklace enchant as well. That's pretty damn cool. Get enough for an earth shock. So let's use it. He is down. Let's get back towards the middle. Yeah, everyone is behind me. That's good. Let's see what else is happening here. We've got all the guards here again. Super, super one-sided. Um, top damage so far, apparently. Uh, oh, we should definitely mount up. That's a bit faster. Oh, maybe we can go after that warrior a bit. All right, then we'll go after you. Uh, looks like that was actually a mistake, staying behind here. So we're going to try and rectify that by heading back towards my team. I'm going to use a pot, just try to survive, try to get back, knock these bastards away, survive, survive, get back towards the team, just a bit more, just a bit more, go, 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 that should be good, I'm bringing the party to you guys. Okay, go like that. Good. Definitely use your elementals. And Horde wins. Quite one-sided. Let's take a quick look here at the damage done. Um, I'm at 181k. Phobos at 200k. Not that bad. But look at that. Uh, a Shadow Priest. 500,000 damage. And then an Unholy Death Knight with 426. And then we've got another Shadow Priest at 400,000 damage. Now, things are not meant to be completely balanced at this point in the um, pre-patch. But I feel like we did okay here as the two Shaman Elementals. Top of that, we got a little bit of healing in as well. Uh, although, must be said, so did the Shadow Priest. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And we'll see you all next time.